It's been a while since I've done a vlog on anything uh, related to cameras, but what a perfect time for a vlog when vlog is out for the GH4. Well, vlog. A couple of new exciting things out, obviously. Um, vlog for the GH4, even with its, uh, you can go into detail of limitations and problems and lots of people complaining. Uh, there was of course the free release of vlog for the gh4 and then the subsequent patch that took that away i think the bigger more exciting news is the footage from the new micro four thirds native mount slr magic single focus all-in-one anamorphic cine lenses now right now i'm shooting with the slr magic 2x anamorphic front adapter now with that there are some focus challenges, but it, it does provide a great anamorphic image, as you can see here, what I'm filming with. Now there's gonna be three lenses, a 35, a 50, and a 70 millimeter, all in native four thirds mount. The GH4 now supports a, a true anamorphic mode. And with V-Log, I, I think that gives us a little better dynamic range to work with, especially with external recorders. And it's kind of a, an exciting time for tiny cinema cameras you know the it's the black magic pocket was kind of uh an exciting release when that came out um i i think the gh4 is kind of that next step past that even with its limitations and um, you can go and everyone will talk about how bad or good the vlog can be and uh, how much it's limited certainly it, it is limited but at the same time uh, look at where we've come in the past 15 years so we're talking about a small tiny anamorphic native camera in the gh4 they run off a, a single battery for multiple hours uh, if you told someone that uh, a little tiny camera like that could could produce an image like that in even the early 2000s no one would would believe you Honestly, with that, I, I think now that uh, more than ever, the limitations aren't really in the camera anymore. The limitations are with those that are shooting with the camera. Uh, obviously, cameras will keep getting better. Dynamic range will get better. Uh, recording formats are better, and that's all good. But the limitations <laughs> have been for uh, quite a while now. After we have got out of the, the SD type DSLR cameras, it's more with the person behind the camera than uh, the actual ability of the camera. In fact, people that I know that shoot amazingly, way better than me, could do better with an old DVX100 than I could do with uh, anything, an Alexa, an Epic. So the point is, these are exciting times, uh, really exciting cheap products. We're talking about a set of three anamorphic lenses for 3,000 and, and less each? That's, that's crazy. It's crazy. Truly, we are living in the future.